Hey guys, I got a lot of questions how I use the MRTK toolkit with the Unreal Light and its hand tracking. And now I'm going to show you how I'm using Takashi Yoshinaga's MRTK profiles for Unreal. Now let's import the NR SDK. Now import the MRTK SDKs and start with the foundation. If you want to use the MRTK example scene for hand tracking, this step is important. Now let's also download the other SDKs, just so we have everything we could possibly need. You see that we have a MRTK setup and some errors regarding Unreal. First, let's fix the errors. For this, we just go to Build Settings and Build for Android. Now that we've built for Android, we can now fix the Unreal box. Just go on fix for all of them. Finally, we can close the window 
and begin the MRTK setup. We choose the recommended legacy XR, go to next and apply. Now we should finally be set up and we can go to the example scene. We go to MRTK, Examples, Demos, Hand Tracking, and then to Scenes. And here we choose the Hand Interaction Examples. Now we are in our sample scene. But we see that we don't have any Unreal prefabs. So let us just add the necessary prefabs first. Now remember, this is a MRTK scene for HoloLens. We need to set it up for our Unreal. First, we don't need the Async Coroutine Runner. Then, we can add the NR Camera Rig. Just drag it in your hierarchy. Make sure that this is on Tracking 6DOF. Next, we can add the NR input. Make sure that this is on Hands. Then we will check if we have right and the left hand. We see that we don't have any hands. To get our hands, we just look for them in the prefabs. Now, we already have a raycast for our MRTK, so we don't want the raycast on our Unreal hands, so we're just going to disable them. Ok guys, the last step before you can use the hand tracking with your Unreal light glasses is to add the profile from Yoshinaga. For this, you just go under Mixed Reality Toolkit. And then you choose the Unreal Hand Mixed Reality Toolkit Configuration Profile. If you don't see this profile yet, you have to save, close your project, start it again and then you should see it. You can also see it by typing Unreal and this is the Hand Tracking Configuration. Now all you have to do is just to go to the Build Settings, add your Open Scenes and Build. Now we have our APK. Let's see. This is our test APK. Now we want to get it onto our glasses. For that I use screen copy. I connect my developer kit, we can see it here, and I will bring the APK onto my device using screen copy. If you don't know screen copy and you want to know how to set it up, just let me know and I will do a tutorial about it. We see here my other APKs. Now to get this APK onto my device we just drag it in. We will wait a few seconds and it will add automatically to my device. Now you can just start the application and have fun. Thanks for watching.